thank you, Mayor. I certainly want to echo and thank all of you for being here today. It is a, a special day, and we often take things for granted, like our drinking water, but yet it's something that we should not take for granted. There's a lot of time and effort and money that goes into making sure we have safe, affordable, quality drinking water. So I want to give just a little bit of history about this plan and how it came to be. Uh, going back to the uh, late 80s, the city's water was suffering from infiltration from a major sinkhole in the Wivacoochee River. So at the time, the city's uh, plant was elsewhere and its wells were in the downtown area and there was a major sinkhole. So uh, surface water was infiltrating the groundwater. And in South Georgia, the drinking supply typically comes from groundwater. In North Georgia, it's typically surface water. So it's two completely different treatment systems. So that was causing the city's water to have a uh, compound called trihalomethanes, uh, which was unsafe. So we made a decision to uh, spend a tremendous amount of money searching for the best water in Lowndes County, well outside any source of infiltration or sinkhole. And this property was selected after about a year's worth of analysis and spending a lot of money. So this is about a 280 acre tract that was acquired. Uh, the plant sits on about 30 acres. As the mayor said, it was built in 1992, and uh, the remaining 250 acres is actually now mostly Freedom Park. So it's a great example of co-locating and sharing resources as a government and taking something, uh, excess land, and making a park out of it. But what's interesting about that is most people don't know that scattered throughout the remainder of that 250 acres are eight drinking water wells, and there's actually two more now that we are drilling and testing now to have uh, future wells. And each of those wells can withdraw about 1.5 million gallons each per day. And so all of those wells withdraw that amount of water each day. It comes through this plant, a very sophisticated, at the time one of the first in the southeast ozone uh, treatment plants. Ozone's the primary disinfectant. And a staff of only 11 operate this, this amazing facility. Uh, so each day, like I think Tenry said today, we're, uh, it appears we're running a flow of about seven and a half million gallons that will be withdrawn from those wells, treated by this plant, delivered through 390 miles of transmission lines and smaller lines to over 20,000 customers of the city. And all of those are going to get a product <coughs> that is clean, safe, and affordable. And that's something that we're very proud of. Um, the plant was built in 92 and it had a capacity of 15 million gallons, but within 10 years we were approaching peak days in July where we were nearly the plant capacity. So we made a decision to expand it, and Mayor, you were correct, the original cost was about 20 million for a 15 million gallon plant in 92. By the time the plant was expanded in 2007, to add seven and a half million gallons, that same seven and a half million gallons cost that same 20 million dollars. Uh, so those are those just show the, the price in the market of, uh, of technology and construction. And as you said, the plant was designed in 2007 for a future final doubling of its size to 45 million gallons of capacity per day. So this plant has a capability of producing about 22 and a half million gallons of water a day. So as we said, it's something we're very proud of. Um, last year, this plant was named as the outstanding drinking water plant for uh, a plant of its size in the state of Georgia. Uh, that's a very prestigious honor. Um, it's hard to imagine the numbers can get real big, but this plant, uh, over the course of a year, uh, withdraws and treats and delivers 3.9 billion gallons of water uh, a year to the customers of the city. And we serve customers in the city as well as outside the city. We serve residential customers, commercial customers, industrial customers, so uh, all sorts of customers by this plan. And it's something we're very proud of, and we're pleased that you have the opportunity to see it and see how well it operates and uh, the great service that it provides. I'll be happy to take any questions, or Henry, you have something?